This chess set can be purchased on Amazon for around $28. And as you can see, the uh, features on the uh, figures are pretty clear for an inexpensive set. But I thought they were pretty bland, so I decided to paint them. The molds leave lines in the uh, figures, so the first thing you want to do is to get an X-Acto knife and some fine sandpaper and get rid of those. This will take a while, but once it's completed, get a bowl and fill it with warm water, a few drops of dishwasher soap, put the pieces in there, scrub them down to get rid of all the oil and dirt, and then rinse them off and uh, take them out and let them dry. The pieces now need to be primed. Use a flat, light color, like a white or a gray, such as this uh, can of Rust-Oleum. Follow the directions on the can. Spray two or three very light coats. Let them dry overnight and you're ready to paint. I used uh, acrylic paint because they're, they're water soluble and a combination of flat and uh, glossy paint. Uh, the flat, for example, for the uh, flesh tones and the gloss for the armor. After I finished painting, I noticed that the bishop really looks like a Roman general. I found these bishops on eBay. They're from E.S. Lowe's and the, <clears throat> and the scale is perfect. So I repainted them and uh, put miters on their head and it worked out perfectly. If you haven't painted uh, miniatures before, go online because there are several really good videos and they go into detail on how to paint them. If you notice the beautiful paint job on the shields, <laughs> I'm just kidding you. I got those uh, decals from a uh, company in Great Britain. Uh, and they're pretty inexpensive. I think they ran about six or seven dollars for uh, each set. So I had about two sets of them. If you're going to play with these pieces, spray them with dull coat to protect the paint. 